What is up, everybody? This is Cody, AK DFS Prodigy, coming to you live to talk about the upcoming overlay DFS matchup shot picks. So, as you can tell, they got some picks uploaded, and we're just basically just going to go through them and pick out our favorite ones, talk about them a little bit, and go on from there. So, if y'all can, before we start the video, do me a big favor and hit that like button for me. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. It helps me out a ton, of course, as y'all know. And basically, let's just start it off. Tom Brady versus Teddy Bridgewater. So this matchup is interesting to me because the Buccaneers defense is not that bad. Neither is the Carolina defenses. I think Carolina will be playing from behind though. And we have Mike Davis, who is going to be the lead back, which will basically open up a ton of pass catching options for Teddy Bridgewater. So, I mean, we saw Tom Brady have a horrible performance last week, which I think he bounces back in a huge way. I like Tom Brady. Carson Wentz versus Daniel Jones. I don't know why Carson Wentz is only a negative 2.5 favorite. I think he could skyrocket to a huge favorite. So I think you should definitely pounce on that one and go get you some Carson Wentz. I like Carson Wentz a lot this week, and I'm just all over it. So the reason why I like Carson Wentz is because Dallas Carter is back. <coughs> so that opens up another pass catcher that Carson Wentz loves to go to. So give me some Carson Wentz at negative 2.5. Again, another one, Deshaun Watson versus Baker Mayfield, of only negative 3.5. Go lock in Deshaun Watson as fast as you can, negative 3.5. Him and Will Fuller have been on a tear along with Brandon Cooks. Baker, we know how Baker is. Go get you some Deshaun Watson. Aaron Rodgers versus Jake Lawton. I do like Aaron Rodgers a lot, to say the least. But a negative 7.5, it's a little scary to me. So I'm staying away from that. Matthew Stafford versus Alex Smith. Now, Kenny Galladay does play. I like Matthew Stafford a lot at negative three. If he doesn't, then I'm just off at this matchup completely. I think Alex Smith is a viable quarterback who is pretty good. So I could see you going to either one. I'm off. Chris Godwin versus Mike Evans. So we typically see Chris Godwin have a better game than Mike Evans does whenever Chris Godwin is fully healthy, which he is in this matchup. Mike Evans is virtually just invisible. Give me some Chris Godwin, negative one. Fournette versus Ronald Jones. We never know who's going to pop off first. I'm off of that. Shepard versus Ingram, that's another tough one to me. That's not my favorite. Marvin Jones versus Danny Amendola. I love Marvin Jones this week, especially if Kenny Alde is out. Now, Kenny Alde is in. It still makes Marvin Jones a viable play, and Amendola is basically out of the picture. So go lock in Marvin Jones as fast as you can, no matter what. Tony Brown versus Rob Garkowski. Meh, not on that one. Not on Robert Anderson, and DJ Moore. Either one can go off. I do love Mike Davis at negative five, though, versus Curtis Samuel. Mike Davis is the lead back. Like I said, we, we've seen him have go off in games. I love Mike Davis in all formats. Kyler Murray versus um, Josh Allen. That's going to be a high-scoring game. I'm not on either one. I could see you get some Josh Allen plus two, but, I mean, either guy could go off. Herbert versus Tua. Now, we did see Tua have a good game last week and get basically coming into form, and his favorite target will be now Devontae Parker with Preston Williams now out. So I do like Justin Herbert, though, negative 2.5. Drew Locke versus Derek Carr. Um, that's another tough one to me. I think they're two viable QBs that are basically the same. Keenan Allen versus Mike Williams at plus six is a big number to me. I'm off of that. Henry Ruggs versus Nelson Aguilar. I like Henry Ruggs at negative one. I think he's a more viable option. Russell Wilson versus Jared Goff. Now, this is a tricky one for me to break down, so let me start it off. Russell Wilson does have the rushing upside, which we like to see. He goes off in games he's supposed to go off to. He's on a high score in offense, high team total, high everything. So is Jared Goff, though. Jared Goff is Cooper Cup and Robert Woods. Basically, the mini version of DK Metcalf and Tyler Lockett. So I'm not on either one. Big Ben versus Joe Burrow. That's another just man matchup to me. Metcalf and Tyler Lockett, we never know who we're going to get. I do like Cooper Cup over Robert Woods. Cooper Cup is a more consistent target than the two. Alvin Kamara versus Michael Thomas. That's not, I'm not going on either one. Jerry McKinnon and Brady, Brandon Ayo come on on. So, as y'all can tell, guys, my favorite one is Carson Wentz. I love Deshaun Watson. I love Chris Conwin. I love Marvin Jones. I love Mike Davis, Herbert, Ruggs, and Cup. My favorite one would be, though, Deshaun Watson and the Carson Wentz one. Those might be my two top ones. So, that basically wraps up for me, everybody. I hope this video finds you some wealth and sign find you some money hit that like button for me again guys and subscribe to my youtube channel that's been a lot i hope everybody has a good and safe day have a good one everybody